recording a video. I've been gone for a long time. M E L I N I N. I'm talking melanin. I want that chocolate fix like I'm snacking on some MMs. I like the way you curve, like your body's from the ancients. Put my fingers through your hair, shake your curse, cause you amazing. You a black queen. Cause I see you chase your dreams. They try to hold you down, but his hands about your means. Like Hey you guys, it's Jess. Welcome back to my channel. You guys, I don't know what, I just... Anyway, so, um, here I am again. Bonnet, head tie, wrap. I'm looking a mess. I be in my bonnet daily. Daily. I've had this in my hair for at least two days. Um, it was a cute low bun, low puff at a, at a, at a season, but that, that season has come and gone. So let's just get into today's video. Let me come closer because like we're really about to get in. Okay, that's better. So I don't know if you guys have ever been on Facebook or I haven't really seen it on Instagram that much, but there is this thing called the rub test or the rub challenge. And it sounds, it sounds, I don't know what you're thinking, but it's about this edge control. I saw this video on Facebook and I, I freaking fell for it. It kept popping up on my feed. It took like maybe six times for me to watch this video for me to purchase this product. So it's basically a long lasting edge control. They claim your search for the perfect edge control is over. This lasts up to three to five days before needing to reapply. We're gonna stop there. We're gonna stop there. My normal edge controls last up to maybe three hours before I need to reapply. So this is kinda three days. I don't know, my good sis. No more curling up after 10 minutes. Apply evenly, rub until dry. For stronger hold, apply a second layer and repeat. So I'm going to put up the video here of what got my attention and what I was like, okay, I have to try this. So here's the video that I saw on Facebook. like I have to try it so shut up Jessica just try it so I don't know if I should try it on my whole head or if I really should do like one side with this and one side with my regular edge control so I'm gonna use an unnamed brand on this side and I'm gonna use this coil care enthroned edge control on this side so I'm gonna just put my hair in a high puff off camera really quick and then I'm gonna come back on camera to show you guys the application of this edge control that lasts three to five days I don't know my All right, so I put my hair in a bun. Let me give you guys a before shot of what my edges look like before I put any product on them so I can get real close to y'all boys. All right, so here we are. My edges are laying down from the gel, but they're not laid, you know what I'm saying? So back to this product here. I don't remember if I said this earlier, but I think I paid $12 for this as opposed to the other brand, which I'm not gonna show you guys real quick. Okay, that I spent maybe three, four, five dollars. I spent maybe like three, four, or five dollars for it. And I use this one all the time. I got this like a month ago and I haven't opened it. I haven't tried it because I want to have an initial reaction and really just give you guys a full like first time of whatever. So I don't know if it's black, I don't know if it's clear, whatever, we're gonna just find out right now. Oh, it is black. I did, I, well, I really, really, really didn't know it was gonna be black. So this is what it looks like on the inside. Like I said, I have not even, I have not touched it, I have not used it. Oh, it's pretty, th oh, it's not black, it's clear actually. It's black in here, but it's clear on my finger. Interesting, okay. That? How did they do that? Maybe it's because, is it because the bottle's black? Is that what it is? Okay. I'm an idiot. So y'all, I have my handy dandy toothbrush, but what I've been doing lately is taking gel or edge tamer and like taking a gulp of it, putting it on my hand and first smoothing it back to get my whole head together. So I'm gonna use the other brand, the other guys, first. And like I said, this is my favorite edge control, so if you know what I'm talking about, that's good for you, but if not, Sorry sis. I'm gonna use my favorite brand first and slide that back. You can already like see the difference between like that slick laid look and like, you know, you know what I'm saying? It's okay, you don't have to see it. All right, so I admit, I'm really not the best at doing my edges, but you know, assist doing what she can do. So that's that side. 
And then I'm gonna try this. So the texture is not as stiff or thick as the other brand texture that I'm using. It feels a lot softer actually, so I'm kind of, wow, this is way softer. So I'm really intrigued to see the hold. Oh. The hold is good. Okay, the hold is good. The hold is fantastic. Wow, that hold is crazy. That hold is very on my head. <laughs> Yikes, that's crazy. Okay, so let's do up these edges. So this is what this side is looking like right now. <laughs> anyway, we're not gonna talk about the design, but we're just gonna, we're focused on the hold, okay? Why am I so close to the camera? Okay, let's move back. So before I do the little rub test or whatever, I'm gonna set my edges with my scarf for like 10 or 15 minutes. Like I always do, this is nothing new. So I'm gonna set this really quick. I want to give both sides a chance to set. Now I'm not even going to try the rub the rub test or the rub challenge or whatever on this side because this side edge control never claimed to to live through no rub challenge. Like I've never heard of that before. We're going to be fair, okay? But this side it claimed to you can put your finger like this on it and it's not moving. So we're going to see and it's supposedly supposed to last 3 to 5 days, but we're going to see how long it lasts. I'm going to come back and we're gonna do our little rub test and then I'm gonna come back later today to show you both sides. We'll get there when we get there, so I'll be back. Okay, you guys, so it's been about 30 minutes and I let my hair sit and bake underneath this scarf here. So we're just gonna take it off and see what we have going on. Okay, so yeah, my, my edges look good, that's great and all, but like, is it gonna pass the rub test. Is it gonna pass the rub test? Uh, like a part of me doesn't even wanna do it because I don't wanna mess up my edges for no reason, but according to the video, they was all like and the edges didn't move, so I don't wanna mess up my hair. All right, we're gonna come close. Take my finger. Oh, heck not. Hmm. I mean. It's not bad. I feel like I did mess it up a little bit, but I'm not even gonna try that with this side of my hair. Um, I think the whole rub test thing was a little exaggerated because it did move a little bit, but what I'm more so wanting to see is if my hair is going to last for the rest of the day, let alone three to five days. So I'm gonna go about my day. Right now it's like 2.45 p.m. So I'm gonna come back to you guys in a few hours, maybe like before I go to bed or something when I get back home from running around, and we're gonna see. I can already see that this side is literally rising already, but it's okay. Okay, one more last look of what it looks like right now. Both sides. And we're just gonna come back later and see what's the hype. I spent like $12, $13 on this thing. So, you know, we're gonna see. I'll be back later to show you guys what I'm looking like. But I mean, so far it's not bad. I'm feeling good. Okay, you guys, so it's nine o'clock p.m. I went and went about my day with my edges and I mean, Y'all can really see what's going on here. Like this is the side of the expensive edge control. What is it called again? I don't really know. Arcani Coil Care Enthroned Edges Long Lasting Edge Control Hashtag Rope Challenge. It's still, it's still literally in place. Like it has not moved. Now sis over here, you know, uh, she's not doing as well. You can see she's still there but she's not there, there, you know what? And actually, I um, now that it's dry, this rub challenge is actually, it's pretty, uh, it's pretty legit. You know, the only thing I'm gonna do now is see if it lasts me until tomorrow morning, if it's still nice and 
slick tomorrow morning. So far, it's doing what it said it was gonna do. And the fact that it's still on my head and in formation, in place, hasn't moved a muscle, like, I'm, I, I'm pretty impressed, you know? But yeah, so we will reconvene tomorrow morning and see how it's doing. Y'all have a good night. Okay, you guys, so it's the next morning. The birds are chirping, the kids are screaming, and here we are. So all I really wanna do is just take this off to see if my edges are still intact. I haven't looked. My thing has slid back a little bit, so I can kinda see up here it looks like it's still together. But we're just gonna see how together I mean, it's not the worst. It's definitely, it definitely held up way better than this side did. It's not snatched anymore, but I think it did a really good job. For the price that I paid, it had better held up a little bit better, but it's definitely way better than my preferred edge control. Not calling any names, not calling any names. We need these sponsorships, sis, we do. For anyone who has a hard time laying their edges, I would definitely recommend this edge control for like the 10th time. What is it called? Uh, Arc, Arcani, Arcani, girl, I don't know. Coil care and thrown edges, long lasting edge control. So anyways, I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.